here when we're back, and yes, it has been a long time since I've played this game, and yes, it looks a lot blurrier, a lot blurrier, much more blurry, I have an explanation. As you can see, there's no more lag. I finally cracked um, and turned my emulator to the software render setting instead of the hardware render setting. Um, my computer is not strong enough, apparently, to do this game in particular on hardware, because for some reason, Shadow Hearts is really system intensive on the graphics card. But throwing it into hardware, Got rid of all of the slowdowns as far as I've seen so far. <laughs> um, as a side effect, you know, it's not as pretty. But I think... Now let me know in the comments which one of you guys prefer. Having the slowdown, but having better the, the better graphics. You know, the slowdown screwing up the audio. Or having, you know, everything running smoothly, but having a less... Having the PlayStation 2 graphics. But for now... I think I'm going to Prague. God, I haven't played this game in months. <laughs> also, two more excuses. Rabbits shoot through all my computer cords, and I had to wipe my hard drive before that, so I lost files and had to re-get them. Oh, where the hell is I going? Hi, you're sleeping. Z, 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 Z. Shouldn't you be awake? Shoot, you caught me again. I, I wasn't sleeping, though. Oh, right, he's a lottery dude. Uh, no, bye dude. Uh, where the fuck am I going? I don't know. <laughs> Shit. Am I going in here? Oh, yep, yep. Cutscene. <laughs> hey there, Alice Zhu Zhen. Looks like your company has grown. I have a message for you from Margaret. <gasps> Uh-oh. A message? Oh god, I can't remember how to do any of these characters' names. Uh-huh. I thought she would just wait here until you two got back, but she rushed off in a big hurry. She said she wanted to meet you in Rouen, north of Paris. Rouen? I feel like I've done this before. Hold on. Okay, that was weird. I got a lot of deja vu for this particular cutscene, and I thought I'd already recorded this, so I went and checked my playlist to make sure because it's been that long. No, I haven't. I'm just having deja vu because I've played this game before. <clears throat> What's the matter? Why the sudden outburst? Rowan is the place where my father fought bacon and died. <laughs> my, where my father fought bacon. Just, just that evil pig flesh. <laughs> is that right? But why did Margaret do that? It's been quite a while since she went off on her own in an attempt to track down bacon. Maybe this means she's finally got some leads. I see. So, he's been hard at work even after I got swallowed up by that beast in Shanghai. I'm sure Bacon is somewhere in Europe. Either England or Rouen. Margaret is looking for him, but to no avail. <laughs> this is really old-timey language there. <laughs> Considering how he taunted us to come after him. He must have some trick even more sinister than De Hwai's up his sleeve. We've got to find him. We haven't heard a peep out of him for a whole six months now. Hey, why so glum? You're back safe. Let's celebrate. Let's party. Whoa. You're drunk. <laughs> drunk, ladies, drunk. Me? Drunk? No way. Super drunk. Good grief. Hmm. Roger Bacon. Hmm. Do I understand correctly that another member of your party is waiting for you in France? Yes. Hey, friend! Hey! Where's this France place, anyway? Is it far? <laughs> oh, dumbass Yuri strikes again. From here, it's... Let's see. Well... Sort of southwest from Prague ish. Mostly west. Come on, Pops, you either know or you don't. Of course I do. What do you think I did on the long boat trip from China? I studied up real good, that's what I did. So, anyway, let's see. Dude, you have Keith there, he probably knows. Come on, Pops, you're a regular country bumpkin. Oh, shut up! No one. Takes one to no one. 
dumbasses. I think it takes less than a month to get there. I'm sure we can catch a carriage somewhere along the way. Oh yeah? So what are we waiting for? You're right. What do you say, Alice? Yes. In that case, we'd better get a solid meal in our bellies before we set out. Say, whatever happened to Yuria? The drunk girl who went into the bathroom. She hasn't come out of the bathroom for eight, for ages for more like 30 seconds. <laughs> She's probably out cold. You saw how drunk she was. I'll go take a look. I'm gonna get attacked by a monster in there. Okay, this is gonna end poorly. Yuria! Is there something in there? No. Yuria! Yuria, are you okay? <laughs> she has to go into the stall for some reason. Yuria, are you in there? No, Yuria. This is so strange. Where did she go? Da da da. There's nothing wrong with this mirror. Uh <laughs> Okay. It's been 200 years since I last saw France. I wonder what it's like now. What is it, Alice? <laughs> I can go with you. You can't go into the Batgirl's bathroom, rude. Okay. Let's try to- nope. Get, go check the fucking window with the evil Alice in it. Or the freaking thing with the evil Alice, okay? Can I check again? Hello? Anybody there? Yuria? Nope. Still nothing. <laughs> Not in the here either. What's going on? Check the mirror again! Uh oh! What the? This is when you call, uh, Yuri, I need some help in here! <laughs> <laughs> ah, shit. Who? <laughs> An evil monster, obviously. It's gone. Was that an illusion? Check again! I know you're in here! Come out! <laughs> Seriously, shouldn't she be calling for, like, Zhu Zhen or Yuri at this point. Your tricks won't work on me. Um. Um. <laughs> I'm an old lady with a spider on my back. <laughs> okay. That's not me. <laughs> You're the one who killed Terry! <laughs> That's right. That was the mayor's request. What a beautiful young woman you are. Makes you feel good just assuming your form. If your body were to become mine... <laughs> Rude! <laughs> Why you gotta be so rude? Seriously, call for Yuri. Call for Yuri, call for Zhujang, call for Keith. <laughs> the fuck is she doing thinking she has to do this shit on her own? Okay. Of course, now I have to do this shit <laughs> with my weakest party member. Rude? Y'all rude. Mother trucker. <laughs> Just took out a whole bunch of my AMP. So I figured there's one thing that I should bring up for you guys. Mother trucker. Um, I'm actually going for the bad ending in this game. There are two endings to Shadow Hearts. There's two endings to the sequel as well. But I'm going for the bad ending. I could do the extra stuff to get the good ending in this game. But 
the bad ending is the canon ending, sort of. It, it's complicated. But the bad ending is what goes into Shadow Hearts 2 and heavily, heavily has to deal with the Shadow Hearts 2, sto Shadow Hearts 2 Covenant storyline. So I'm going to actually get the bad ending. This is probably going to be the first Let's Play on my channel where I've purposefully not gotten the good ending. Um, so yeah, we're going to be going straight to the bad ending instead of getting the good ending. It's gonna be a thing, cause I kinda got it. If I want, if I ever let's play Shadow Hearts 2, which I do own, um, that's what it's gonna be going into, so. Not bad. I knew you were a first rate exorcist. I'll let you go for now. I'll be more careful next time. You were under my spell the moment you entered the bathroom. What's wrong, Alice? No, now he fucking comes in. Y you! Hmm. <laughs> You're back from the spirit's graveyard, eh? I'm sure you'll make Lord Bacon proud. I'm Arcane Ulga. Remember my name. I'll be seeing you again. <laughs> okay, creepy lady. Arcane Ulga? A new enemy? No, she's your best friend. So that's what happened to you. What's a relief that you came out of it unscathed. But you have to give the guy credit for how he set his trap without annoying. I thought it was an old grandma. <laughs> On top of that, we now know she's connected to Bacon's- Wait, what? Okay, Jijen, just pick a pronoun and stick with it. <laughs> the plot thick- That was not my Yuri voice. <laughs> The plot thickens once again. Now I'm really looking forward to France. Dot dot dot. Alrighty then. No, I want Keith. <laughs> I love you, Zhuzhen. I love you, and I'm gonna let you finish, but you can't turn into a bat. <laughs> I don't know which- I can't remember which way I go. I'm gonna go another go this way. Wait a minute, hi, Maywan. <laughs> Long time no see, something changed, yes? I've never got- I've never gotten the acupuncture in this game. Every time I've played through- oh, okay, it's the other direction. Every time I've played through this game, I've never done the acupuncture treatment. <laughs> or the only time I ever did it is I got the ultimate weapon for my character, and then I went and did it. But, you know. Let's go to France, even though it takes them a month to get there. A uh, hi, fake Roger Bacon, who's fake. Again, yes, I know you can whine about spoilers, the fact that I'm saying he's fake Roger Bacon, but if you've watched my Codelica Let's Play, which came out before this game, the prequel to this game, sort of, you know why I'm saying he's fake Roger Bacon. I knew you'd be here. That, Olga's voice keeps changing. Ah, you're back. So, how did it go? It's shameful! I couldn't return with that girl. You done goofed. <laughs> Don't worry. We've just begun. We still have plenty of time to hunt her down. Oh, yes. That harmonicer fellow seems to have returned to his normal self and rejoined the party. I couldn't see how far the girl delved into the man's soul, but she's brought him back from the spirit's grave. That ki the kid doesn't look like much, but he's actually quite a troublemaker. We need to get rid of him early on. Lord Bacon, you can't tell me you're afraid of that young boy. Well, I'm not entirely sure what to think. The trouble is that the soul of the Seraphic Radiance remains sealed somewhere deep in his being. Fortunately, he hasn't yet awoken his true power, but if he ever does, he'll be a fearsome enemy. The Seraphic Radiance? An ancient god summoned up by an old man in Shanghai, one of the guardian deities of this planet. No mere human should be able to bring the god into submission, yet he managed to do it. So what power is it that protects him? That's what I want to know. It's Alice's soul, cause she gon' die. Hmm. Lord Bacon, she still hasn't given in yet, has she? 
She may die if you continue to torture her like this. I think you should warn the Inquisitors. You needn't worry. She's not the sort of witch to come to this level of torture. If anything, she's the one with the upper hand. She's merely toying with her Inquisitors who wield the whips. Code Delka! Time to go see Cody! How about a nice cup of tea in the other room? <laughs> Have a nice cup of tea, says the evil man. So, this is Ruin. For a small town, it looks very pleasant. I wonder if Margaret has arrived yet. Well, let's try the inn. Is something wrong, Alice? Hmm? Oh, nothing. She wants to go see her daddy! <laughs> Her dad is dead body. Good evening and welcome. I still got a little bit of slowdown, but it's not as bad. Excuse me, but we're looking for a lady named Margaret. Is she staying here? Miss Margaret? Yes, please wait a moment. Yes, she is staying here, but she's out for the moment. Aha! Uh -huh, so she beat us here. Okay, I guess we'll be staying here too. Some rooms, please. Absolutely, we haven't had a lot of customers lately, so I can give you a deal. You seem to have a lady with you, so I'll prepare two rooms upstairs. Use them as you wish. Thank you. Oh? Are you? Aren't you the young lady who stayed here with her father about a half year ago? Yes. I still remember that incident. Such a terrible incident. Oh, that poor priest rest his soul. But at least you're safe, child. It's a blessing of God. Now go long and rest in your quarters. I love how we don't actually have to pay for it. <laughs> the game just hand waves over it. Arrgh. What the? Well, shit. <laughs> oh, crap. I have to go do something here. Um... Hold on just a minute, storyline. I got shit to do. No, let me, no I want it. See how darkness is carved here. It's not time. Damn it! Okay, I'll fight later. <laughs> Hi! Oh god, these guys. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see if I can remember. Tisk, tisk, tisk! Welcome back, lad. I see you choose to live again in hell. Ho 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 ho! How foolish! You were on the verge of entering paradise where you would no longer experience pain or suffering. <laughs> well, I see you're still a bunch of blabbermouths. I couldn't care less what you say about me! <laughs> <laughs> How strange to hear such lines from one who had not so long who not so long ago was so eager to die. You should be thankful to that little girl. <laughs> That's right. For she has taken upon herself the burden of your karma. What do you mean? Tsk, tsk, tsk. To save your soul from the god of death, the one who wears the fox mask. This girl offered her soul to us. What did you just say? Ho 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 ho, when malice reaches its peak, we'll come for that girl's soul in place of fox face. <laughs> There's... What the fuck did the boy say in his room? There's no escaping from us. I, I keep mixing them, I don't even fucking know. No matter where she runs, her life will eventually burn out, even if she's within your very arms. Damn you! I won't let you lay a finger on her! Your curses are as worthless and as phony as a three dollar bill! You got that? Now apologize! <laughs> you wish to challenge us? How very interesting! No matter how hard you try to protect her, you will fail! All you can do is sit helplessly by and watch this precious life depart! Urgh! Now I'm pissed off! You want some of me? I'll take you on! Tisk, 
tisk tisk. We'll be watching your vain attempts to drive off our spell. Enough! Shut up! Tisk tisk tisk. It's time for you to depart, lad. Your world awaits you. Yeah. So if we don't do a whole bunch of jumping through hoops to defeat them, we get the bad ending. And y'all know what happens in the bad ending. And that's the one we're gonna get! Even though it's gonna tear my heart out to do it. I'm gonna do it. What's wrong, Yuri? Did you have a nightmare or something? N no Don't worry, I just had a bad dream. Uh... <laughs> okay, where's Alice? Baby cakes! Alice is gone. She's gone? Where did she go by herself? Probably to go see her daddy's dead body, duh. <laughs> My ass. Wonder where Alice is. Mother trucker. Okay, let's go get the others. What's that? Alice has disappeared! She wandered off somewhere we'll be arresting. We'd better go look for her right away. I'll go look for her, but she might come back in in, in the meantime. You two wait here. Uh, you only need one person to wait. You just want to get a smooch from Alice. I, I, I see. I see what you're doing there. I, I see what you're doing. Is it this way? No. Okay, so to the church. She was looking over here. Okay. Why did she look in this direction, but goes in another direction? Okay. Alice! Here you are! Dot dot dot. Chest pain! Hi, Yuri. Sorry to disappear on you like that. Hey, is this the place? Yes. This is where my father died. Alice. No, poor baby. He died to save me. Dot dot dot. It's just as if it happened yesterday. That evening, Father and I were waiting here for someone. But before that person arrived... I showed up. Oh shit, son! Sup, nerd? You! Bacon! I don't like pig flesh! <laughs> Long time no see. I've been looking forward to seeing you again. Both of you. Congratulations on your rebirth, Yuri. Returning from the Graveyard of Souls is a laudable feat. Though, of course, Alice here had to sell her soul to the God of Death in order to make that happen. <laughs> I'm not afraid of that masked freak! Well, thanks for showing up here. It saves me the trouble of hunting you down. It's payback for killing Alice's father. At ease, young man. I have no desire to fight the two of you today. I merely wanted to announce myself. Ha! <laughs> Don't hold back on our account, old man. We're ready to go. Or are you afraid? Ah ha! That's right. I'll give you a full course on the house. Is it Margaret? Was I right? Yes, I was right! <laughs> I was right with pulling out the Margaret voice. Margaret! Or is it Margaret? I, I, don't, I still don't know if it's Margaret or Marguerite. I'm just gonna call her Margaret. Hello, kids. So you're okay, huh? We'll talk later. I've got lots of questions for you. <laughs> Another of your friends, is it? You youngsters multiply like viruses. Fine, I'll play along. Step forward, my servant. Bullshit. Hi, Olga. Sort of Olga, not really Olga. Only kind of Olga. Uh, let's turn into a mad bull. <laughs> it's not an iron bull, but it's close enough. Mm, this one. So yeah, it, it hurts my soul so much, you guys. It hurts my soul so much that we're not that we're not going to be getting the good ending because 
I love the good ending so much in this game. But the other part of me is like the schadenfreude of just watching the descent into just badness. <laughs> okay. Now we're gonna do it! I'm gonna get the bad ending! I'm gonna get the bad ending! I'm gonna do it! I'm gonna do it! <laughs> Does that- Okay, the webcam shakes every time I do that. <laughs> You've gained more power. That will make our future readings more interesting. A word of caution. I will no longer merely be playing along in future fights, so be on your guard. Okay, bye. I will no longer be playing along, he says as he fucks off again. Bastard! He got away again! <laughs> Hi, Margaret! How you be? What the fuck? <laughs> it's like just examining his crotchal region. Whoa! I kind of like that. <laughs> Fucking pervert. Ah, it's a ghost. Wait, I'm not- So, you're real? You look solid. I guess you're not a ghost. <laughs> yep, just- I'm just as you see me. You're tougher to kill than a cockroach. Rude. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see you're alive. How are you doing? How's the drunk old man? He's doing well. He's waiting for you at the inn. Great. I've got some crucial information. Let's head back to the inn. Okay. And <laughs> yeah, he's just fucking frozen. Get moving, sonny boy. <laughs> God, I love, I love the writing in this game. It's just, it's just great. Ah, it's good to see you, Margaret. I sensed a massive cloud of evil descending on the town, so I was a little worried. We, ra we ran into Bacon again. This is the name Bacon, oh my god. <laughs> this is so funny. Y you saw Bacon? Did he try to harm you? No. They said hello and went away. Hmm? Oh, I ship it. <laughs> I ship it. I don't care. I ship it. Who is this handsome man? Oh, this guy? He's the master of the castle where I stayed. Yes, I'm the one who took care of the moocher here. My name is Keith, Enchanted Mademoiselle. I'm Margaret, the moocher's babysitter. Nice to meet you, Keith. I ship it. <laughs> ship them so hard. Why did you go out without saying anything, Alice? We were worried. Dot dot dot. I, uh, had shit to do. <laughs> I mean, uh, please don't be angry with me, and if you'd rather not talk about it, fine. But maybe if we knew more about what your father was trying to do, certain details would fall into place. I don't give a fuck, says Alice. That day, my father and I were supposed to meet with a certain person. Who was a certain person? A certain person? My father said this man was a warlock as powerful as Bacon. My father and I traveled all over Europe exercising demons. But my father was working on secret missions for the Vatican. I can't remember if Alice is actually her father's blood child. Because if he was a Vatican priest, implying that he is a Catholic priest, where the hell does he have a kid? <laughs> the Vatican? Um, what's the Vatican anyway? <laughs> Yuri strikes again. <laughs> it's in Italy. It's the seat of the Pope, the leader of the Catholic Church. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, did you actually meet this person? No. Bacon appeared before he arrived. Can I have your attention, everyone? I don't know who he really is, but I've been investigating Bacon closely for the past several months. The first person recorded in history by the name of Roger Bacon appeared in England in the 13th century. As a priest in the Franciscan Order, his scholarly training was at Oxford and the Paris universities. 
His skills as an alchemist and warlock were superb, and his name is known throughout Europe. At that time, he was branded as a revolutionary, but there were also many who felt he was persecuted. It seems he was very critical of the church and was even imprisoned for it. Huh? That guy's 700 years old? So he's not human after all. But as I looked deeper into his past, I began to notice some odd things. Roger Bacon may be a peculiar fellow, but in many ways he seems like a very upright individual. It seems that for years he was also aiding leading scholars in the fields of medicine and chemistry. Upright? Anyway, look at it, that guy's twisted! Why, then, did he kill Alice's father? It doesn't make sense. Cause he's not Bacon. That's it. That's the problem. Finally, in Nuremberg in 1540, something happened that completely changed his life. At the time, all of Europe was caught up in a ma the mass insanity of the witch hunts. Bacon was accused by one of his pupils. The Roger Bacon, the fake Roger Bacon. <laughs> accused? That's not my Susan voice. Accused? You mean he was put on trial before the church? A pupil warned the tribunal that Bacon's research had gone too far, threatening to corrupt society. It finally ended in his exile. After that point, we can only catch glimpses of him throughout history. Such as now, as a force of evil. I see. I guess he got sucked down to the murky black depths of sorcery. So the question is, this person that Bacon was trying to prevent... This person that Bacon was trying to prevent Alice's father from meeting, who on earth could it be? The real Roger Bacon! <laughs> Wouldn't it be best to ask that person directly? Alice? The person who introduced Father Elliot to this mystery man. It was Father Doyle, wasn't it? Yes, but the church was closed and we couldn't get in. Uh-oh! You said his name! <laughs> you fools. Lord Bacon spared your life, yet you still intend to go to the church? I won't let you! <laughs> I mean, we could just break the window and, you know, break into the church. That voice! Arcane Olga. She's watching us from somewhere. Let's hurry. Select party members to participate in the battles. Ah, shit. <laughs> uh, I love you, Margaret, and I'ma let you finish. Wait. No, I need to- I need to make everything neat and tidy! Okay. <laughs> Fuck this shit, I'm out! Saving! Cause you know, it's me, I'm a compulsive saver. <laughs> okay! Fuck this shit, I'm out! Let's go to the church! Door of the church is tightly locked from the inside. Fuck. Happy Leonard. I am concerned. Nobody's talking. Everybody has dog dots and there's monsters around. Oh, crud. <laughs> it's okay, though. I got a Yuri. Bonk, bonk, bonk. And he hits like a truck. <laughs> Then again, so does Keith. No hitting women. Or men. Just don't hit people. It's not very nice. Unless you're, you know, the protagonist and you're trying to kill monsters. Then you can hit people.
Oh! Door- is that the door open? No. Fuck. It's locked from the inside, but it looks easy to open. Break it! Open, damn you! Ah, criminy Christmas. Okay. Oh, crap. <laughs> I, I, I didn't pay attention to the instruction. This said I had to do it three times. <laughs> okay. Let's do this. Fuck! <laughs> Third time's the charm? It took me a dozen total tries. <laughs> hey, take a look! Yay, we broke into the church. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need to say a couple Hail Marys at least. For, you know, breaking into a church. How many Hail Marys do you think that would be? Please note, I am not Catholic. The only, um, type of, uh, retribution thing that I know of is Hail Marys. I think there's a second one, but I don't know. I don't know! I'm an atheist! I don't know this church stuff! <laughs> Fun note! I was raised Lutheran Christian, but yeah, I'm, I'm an atheist. Hi. Don't hate me. <laughs> Stop dying, Alice! Alice needs to stop being weak. <laughs> No, she's pretty magically powerful, but if it's not magic, then she's weak as shit. Get him, Yuri! Get the weird... worm... bird... arm... big arm things with, with the... With, with the branch around their, their stubbly... not leg. Oh, these character designs sometimes. I love them. They're so creative. Not even me being facetious, I actually do really like the character designs. I've said it before in other videos. But the character des the enemy designs for Kodelk in Kodelka, Shadow Hearts 1 and Shadow Hearts Covenant, I love them. They're they're great. I haven't played Shadow Hearts New World. I know nothing about it. I just know that it is almost entirely is either is entirely or almost entirely divorced from um Kodelka, Shadow Hearts, and Shadow Hearts Covenant in terms of like character and storyline. I just never have a had a chance to play it. Hello? Priest! Who, who is it? Hi! You're gonna die. <laughs> if you're a good person, you're gonna die. That's kind of the way this game goes. Hey, are you the priest here? What do you want? Have you come to kill me? Wow, that's an interesting looking uh, image for his face. Father Doyle! It's me, Alice Elliot! Alice? Th that's impossible! Alice was kidnapped by the devil a long time ago! Sh she can't be alive! I'm sorry to scare you, but it is me! I'm finally back in this town. Is, is it really you, Alice? N no, I, I don't believe it! You can't fool me! You're just an illusion! You must be the devil! Come to take my life away! Oh, woe is me! Please, Father Doyle, tell me about the man my father was trying to meet that day. I want to know. Whatever it takes, I must stop Roger Bacon! B Bacon? No! Wait, I I'll tell you everything. J just please spare my life. P please don't kill me. This is quite serious. He thinks we're all Bacon's lackeys. He must have gone through some unimaginably dreadful experience. Father, relax! We're not gonna do anything to you! Just answer our questions! That's all we want, okay? I love how just Yuri's voice is a smoker's voice. <laughs> okay, okay, anything you say. Um, do you need to pray first? What? Alice, I'll tell you everything I know about your father. It all started 23 years ago. In 1890, three secret books of magic were stolen from the Vatican. The books contain forbidden secrets of sorcery and alchemy. 
Long held under lock and key by the Pope, the disappearance of the books caused the Vatican to panic. They immediately called in two of the finest exorcists to find and recover the secret books. One was your father, Father Mor- One was your father, Father Morris Elliot. Again, why does a priest have, like, I know that there are priests that have children. That there are Catholic priests who have children. I just know that it's not the norm because of the whole celibacy and the priesthood thing, but... The other with his friend, Father James O'Flaherty! <laughs> James O'Flaherty! <laughs> okay, for those who don't know who James O'Flaherty is, and just the badass dumbassery of this man, go watch my Kodaka Let's Play. Please go watch my Kodaka Let's Play. It's, a, it's an old one. It's an oldie but a goodie. James O'Flaherty is one of your three party members um, in Kodaka. And also, for for those who are wondering which ending of Kodelka was the canon one, I think I actually got the good ending when I did the Let's Play of it, but the canon ending for Kodelka is the bad ending. Just like the canon ending for Shadow Hearts kind of is the bad ending. Again, I'll explain that kind of when we if I ever Let's Play Shadow Hearts Covenant, because there's, there's a little bit of wibbly-wobbly timey-wimey mess in there. Father O'Flaherty. Oh, was that who I was supposed to meet? The two of them wandered through Europe for many years in search of the missing volumes. They traveled together at first, but when a daughter was born to Elliot, they traveled separately. Then, in 1899, Father O'Flaherty disappeared in England. <laughs> Kodelka. I remember that. I was only five or six years old. It was on the last letter he sent to my father. It said that one of the books had been purchased by a scholar living in Wales, so he went to take a look. But no second letter ever came. We're going- Oh right, we're going to the Nemeton Monastery. Again, a lot of part- A lot of, like, the minutia and the importance of this half of this game makes more sense if you go and watch my Kodaka Let's Play. Because the Kodaka Let's Play takes place entirely in the Nemeton Mon Monastery. Um, and in this game, you go to the Nemeton Monastery. Afterwards, Father Elliot began to hunt for the criminal himself, and then he finally found him. Bacon! And it was Roger Bacon! Da da da. Yes. But Father Elliot was terrified of Bacon. As well he should have been! Bacon's a thousand year old demon! There's no humanity left in him. Your father had to protect his wife and daughter, but he knew if those books were defiled, terrible forces of hell could be summoned to Earth. So, that's the. So that was the Demon's Gate invocation. Curse you, Bacon! <laughs> You steal a holy book and then defile it with your foul experiments? Blasphemy! Rude. In order to discover Bacon's weak points, he continued to help- for, He continued to look for someone who could help him. That person was also a great warlock with a history of conflict with Bacon, because he was the real Roger Bacon! <laughs> Fortunately, I was able to contact him. I was certain that he would prove to be a powerful ally. Huh? So this other guy you're talking about, who is he? Cardinal Albert Simon. <laughs> you guys will understand my oh my god, like my these fucking idiots face in a minute. Alice, that's the man your father was waiting for that evening. <gasps> Albert Simon. So, this Cardinal Bacon didn't want your father to meet. Father, where is Cardinal Simon now? I believe he... And he did! Argle bargle. He did. He a demon now. Hi, Olga. You talk too much, old man. Now, I've... You know, I've always hated churches. Olga! I think it would best if we finish this here. Lord Bacon would be pleased to be rid of unwanted pests. Well, are you ready? Ha! <laughs> what a laugh! When I'm done with you, there'll be nothing left. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, great. Actual proper boss fight time. Which I'm probably going to skip a lot of because my throat is starting to hurt from recording this. <laughs> And got him. So full disclosure, I did actually lose because I wasn't prepared, and I found a vendor in the bottom and the entryway of the inn that actually had all the weaponry I should have had for upgrading. 
Everything's fine, though. Beat it the second time. Easy peasy. Made sure to equip an anti-poison equipment. You. Okay, let's get this done with because I have to finish this episode. This episode is going to be like an hour long. <laughs> Father, hold on! Ugh, Alice! The Cardinal is in London. No, he's not. <laughs> Father! Okay. Can I talk to people now? Yay! Let's go to London. In the next video. <laughs> it's gonna be it for now, you guys. I've been recording for an hour and 15 minutes. Gotta let me throw rest. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I have been playing some Shadow Hearts. I'll see you all in the next video.